All right, so this is a different day and a status report. Basically, uh, my idea was to mount them to the frame like I did on my Tacoma, which is basically, this is the, the, the frame and you would take the bracket, I would make like an L-shaped bracket and then go straight onto there and bolt it up. When I did get the Jeep, and I was able to go down, get under the Jeep and, and look at the frame and figure out where I was gonna mount these brackets to. I realized that the Jeep's frame is very um, cluttered. Like there's the, the body is so small that it has all of the stuff like right up against the frame. So that like the gas tank, fuel tank, it's like right on the frame. So making it impossible for you to put a, a, a bolt all the way through. So, I, I measured some stuff out. I was like, okay, I'll, I'll try to figure it out. The, the bolts were gonna be in like completely different spots everywhere. And it was a little bit crazy, a little bit out of control. So then I went online and I looked up videos on how people mount their sliders and I found that they go straight to the body mounts. So on the uh, two door Jeep Wrangler, there's uh, four body mounts. And basically you take the bolt off and you slide your bracket in and it goes back in easy as that <laughs> so that's what we're gonna be doing today is making those little brackets um, what I saw is they kind of make like little slow boxes little boxes with a hole on top and then the bottom is is um, hollow like it's a hollow box basically and uh, it allows you to it's a big washer on the um, on the on the body mount bolt whatever it, it's a big ass washer so that washer needs to be able to go in there so you make a big box and uh, so that the whole thing fits in and we'll go through it right now and I'm gonna use my plasma cutter to cut these uh, this sheet metal here so I can make the little box So, we have uh, gone ahead and uh, cut up all the little pieces now. I got a ton. So like, this is how much I need in order to make the bracket. <laughs> Four brackets, this so much metal. Um, so yeah, I already cut them up and I cleaned up the edges and uh, tried to make them all as even as possible. Obviously, they're not perfect because uh, my plasma cutting skills are still off and uh, I still mess it up a lot. So anyway, the next part is to go ahead and start welding these. Um, basically, ah, that, that one's hot. What's this one? That's not bad. Okay. So these are the tops, perfect squares. Not really perfect, but anyways, to go ahead and uh, create little boxes here. Little boxes as such. That is the uh, the idea for now. Is uh, this is the bracket, and then once it's a uh, full box, it will. Uh, just go into the into the uh, the body mount, and the bolt will slide right through.
one is done. And uh, that just to kind of get you an idea of what it, what the other ones is going to be like. So basically, a hole will be drilled here. That's where the uh, bolt will go through. And then on this side is nice and big so that the washer can uh, uh, fit. So it's a very big washer and hopefully I made them big enough. I measured it out, but I haven't measured exactly how this one is right now. But hopefully it's enough. And yeah, and then you basically, it's a box, so it's nice and rigid. So then the, um, the, the actual slider portion will weld to here. So, so this slides up into the body mount, and then this is the slider. And then the, the slider will be over here, of course. And pretty much it. And this, this box should be rigid enough to hold all the way of either direction so that's pretty much it got four more or three more boxes to go so all right so there we are four brackets um uh, four boxes <laughs> they're uh they're all they're all in this, like they're not perfect but like this one's a little smaller and like all in all they're they're gonna be tough um and um yeah as long as they fit inside the the, the the positions that i'm gonna put them in i i could care less um they're gonna be hidden and nobody's ever gonna look at the way they look and these are tough 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 boxes i wish maybe i should put welds on the inside but once i put welds on the inside it might uh create uh too much uh too much stuff in the way of the washer because that washer is literally going to fall in like almost flush in here yeah that's that